In previous rounds, Maria Faye Artacho del Solar and Alice Rowe Camper have proved to be an incredible team. In this round, Maria Faye decided to join forces with up and coming Taliqua Clancy. We caught up with this AIS young gun to find out what it is about beach volleyball she really loves. I love beach volleyball because of different challenges you get, especially like in being with a partner, like just you get to celebrate more and just really get to enjoy all the skills a lot more and the challenges that come with it. For the future, I want to go to the 2016 Rio Olympics, bring home a gold medal for Australia and, and go on world tour and be a successful athlete. What motivates me to go to training every morning is just I've always loved sport and I've chose beach volleyball and I, it's one of my favourite sports and I love it so much. So that's enough to get me up and out of bed in the morning, train hard every day. It's so great for our country to have young talents like Taliqua and Maria Faye and it's great in this round to give these younger players some breathing space from the full-time athletes to really step up and show our nation what they're really made of. Well, here we are in the women's final, 11-3 in the first set, Maria Faye and Taliqua leading. That's them nearest to camera. We see Maria Faye going deep down the line. What can Westy do here? Tara West, big bang, but Maria Faye's got that. She just has to save it, and she saves it with a winner. How smart is that? Oh, her trouble shots are so good. A lot of people just would have got that in a play. 12-4 now they lead, still the first set women's final. Taliqua saves that ball out of the net. And again, Maria Fay. Oh, she's picked up this time. Ro Camper has to put a free ball over. Here comes Clancy. Is she going to be big? Oh, <laughs> that's pretty big. That was absolutely enormous. She's such a tall athlete and with no block, I mean, <laughs> nobody can get that. 15-9 now the score. Alice Ro Camper serving it up. Here comes Talika again. She's got a block in front of her now. Westy gets a good touch on it. Can they turn it into a point? Free ball's got to come over. What can Taliqua do on this occasion? They got her once. Oh, and they got it twice. Yeah, but hang on a minute. Taliqua's going up to the referee. I think she's arguing that earlier in that rally there were four touches and the referee's given it to her, so she, she got the point. All right, 19-13 now. Maria Faye serving. Only a couple of points away from the first set. Oh, the overpass. And there is no question on that one. This is crushed. We've got a set point situation, 20-13. Tara West now, what can she do? And that one, no touch on that, that's out. So the first set in the bag for Maria Fay and Taliqua Clancy. See that beautiful roll shot down the line, but it's just gone deep. So that is a clinical first set. Maria Fay and Taliqua haven't played a tournament together this summer. They've won the first set of the women's final. Oh, John, it's just fantastic for them. They're looking like a couple of experienced players right now. 5-1 now, the second set underway. Maria Fay and Taliqua with a handy lead to start this one. Great defence, classic Maria Fay. Can she execute? Yes, she can. She doesn't just put it down the line, she actually puts it on the line. So Alice was almost there, but couldn't dig it. 7-3 now the score for Alice and Tara. They've got a lot of work to do. Maria Fay is just proving very hard to stop. Nice dig from Alice. Can she convert? No, Maria Fay's there again. They know each other's game so well. This time off the blocking hands of Tara West. What a nice point for Maria Fay that time. 11-5 now the score in the second set. The digging of Maria Faye is outstanding. Here goes Alice. Oh, this time, the tall athlete, Taliqua Clancy. Oh, and she's beaten at the net by her own game. She gets out joust. Wow, 12-6 now. We've got Taliqua serving and coming in to block. Great athleticism. Maria Faye pops another one. She's everywhere in the backcourt at the moment. Can Alice convert? Oh, not this time. Alice has just got to put that ball in the sand, but Marie Faye's not letting her do that. Tara West gets a turn. Over the top, yeah, she gets that one. She's happy about that. Solid hit for Tara. Oh, this will look great. The West Australian just taking a bit of pace off the ball, bringing it down sharply. She enjoyed that. 18-9 now the score. Maria Faye well on her way to a championship unless Alice and Tara can do something. Oh, it's No Aliqua. way. Talik was just a wall. See how high she gets out of the sand. Arms over the net. What a player. Now Maria Faye again gets the set. Oh, it's crushed at cross court. That was a monstrous hit at a big time in this match. Brings up gold medal point. What can she do here with gold medal point in her hands? Up she goes again. Soft hit over the top of the turn of Maria Faye and Taliqua Clancy. Oh my gosh, what a win. Such young athletes and such experience play. 
Wow, we have just seen the future of women's beach volleyball in this country. Oh, it feels amazing. I mean, we got out strong since the beginning and we stuck to it till the end. We stuck together as a team, stuck to our plan and just went hard at it and didn't let go. It was awesome. I think being with Maria Faye on court, she gives me a lot of confidence. So just she lets me know like I can back myself in and go for it and whatever happens, happens. <laughs> What a sensational effort by all our finalists. They have made it a fantastic round five over the Renault National Beach Volleyball Series. Join us for the next episode when we head back to Surfers Paradise for round six of this eight-part series. On behalf of the entire team, thank you for watching and we look forward to seeing you next time.